You are now in the bat zone. Bats are all around your room right now. Bats are nocturnal, meaning they sleep during the day, but they are awake at night. These bats are not normal. They will not sleep or stop flying until you learn some bat facts. These bizarre bats buzzing around your building means you can't leave your room until you solve four clues. Keep watching and listening to find your first clue to lock one. There are more than a thousand species of bats. The hoary bat is the most widespread of all the bats. There are small bats like the little brown bat, it's only three inches, and large bats like the giant golden crowned flying fox bat. It wraps its very long wings around its body like a cloak. But our favorite bat to think about, the bat that has been involved with legends for centuries is the blood-sucking vampire bat. <laughs> Okay, seriously, vampire bats are fascinating creatures. They have a short muzzle, very small tail, small ears, and they don't weigh more than about two ounces. They do have a wide mouth that opens to show their very sharp and scary teeth. They can walk, run, or fly. These bats live on a liquid diet and their anatomy fascinates even experts all around the world. They are the only blood-eating mammal in the world. They suck the blood and are evil! <laughs> okay, just kidding. They actually cut a tiny little tiny spot on an animal and then they lick the blood with their tongue. This can last 20 to 30 minutes and the animal never feels anything because the bat spit has a local anesthetic. Vampire bats are actually very caring and social creatures. The young is well cared for by the mothers. Even if a mother doesn't return, the other mothers will take care of the baby bat. They share food with each other. If one bat doesn't get enough food from their addings, other bats will share, something that the other species of bats don't do. A baby bat is called a pup. They don't fight for territory. They like to hang out with each other in large numbers. The place where a group of bats live is called a colony. Some colonies have more than a thousand members. Some only have about 40. They might roost in dark hollow trees, caves, or even dark buildings. They roost together in the same place year after year. Bats use something called echolocation to find their prey. Echolocation is when objects or prey can reflect sounds. Dolphins and bats use echolocation to find objects. Your first clue to lock one is the word for the place where a group of bats live. If you don't remember the name of the place, go back and rewatch this video.